Vox is a nonprofit organization by teens for teens, meaning all of the content that we produce and everything that we do is teen centric and it's led by teens. So when I was 12, I actually saw the Vox paper in a public library and it was a very colorful, vibrant color. And so I decided to pick it up and I read through it. There were amazing stories and they all said that they were written by teens. So I looked on the back of the paper and there was an actual application to join the staff. So I decided that, okay, I'm 12, but I'll join anyways, because you have to be 13 through 19. So I filled out the application, sent it in, and then I got in. Since then, I've really improved my writing. My grades in school have gotten better and I've opened up to be able to talk to my peers and even being more comfortable with talking to adults. So with Vox, I'm able to be a leader in the community as well as being a peer-to-peer -peer leader with my friends at school. And empowered woman means to me just being able to stand up for yourself and live against the grain. I would say that my mom is the number one person who inspires me. I come from a single parent household and I know that it has been difficult for her to do things on her own and even being comfortable and talking to me about what's going on in our household. So that's just amazing to me. Warm Hearts Concrete Pillows, that is the nonprofit organization that I'm starting. And I started it because one day when I was volunteering with Jose Feed the Hungry, we had two orders for the same address and they told us to go ahead and keep it, which we thought was a little unorthodox. So we decided to pass out the food that we had left over to the homeless people around Atlanta. So as we were driving around, we noticed that there were a lot of people camping out under the bridges. We had an impromptu blanket drive. It was very successful. We got a lot of gloves, hats, coats, blankets, socks, and we also went out and bought a couple of toiletries and some non-perishable food items and decided to go pass those out to the same people that we saw that day. We are currently working with the Fulton County Courthouse to organize another blanket drive and have an event where we pass out the blankets, coats, and everything else that we've collected to the other homeless people that we see around Atlanta and under the bridges. I do want to make an impact in Atlanta and I don't want to be just another passing face. This is our world and we need to grab it by the reins and really take control of what we're doing. I am a driving force for Teen Voices.